Hello everybody, it's the Maniac next door, and I finally turned up the settings on Spore. As you can tell, our character model is a bit shinier, shadows, turned up the sound too, so you know. Everything will sound a little better, although I'll turn it down a bit on my end here. Won't affect anything for you. Look at this, there's flowers now. Look at there's flowers before. And these little spores in the air, which I'm assuming are from mushrooms. It's quite pretty. Oh, God. <laughs> I remember making the creatures look like this. I don't remember what else I was doing yesterday. Presumably looking for other life forms to annoy. Oh. Alright. So, they don't like us. That is their nest. Good to know. Do -do. Oh, I really socialize these things now. Look at how creepy these are. Alpha man. I brought another. <coughs> sorry, I brought another ally with me. I'd probably be able to actually get those guys on our side. You can have them as pets later and be weird. So stringy and leggy. Oh. I'll kidnap you from the nest, buddy. Pick up the stick. There we go. Let's go back to the man nest, which is... <laughs> Before I move on to tribal stage, I'll probably plug a mouse in now on here and actually uh, get these guys looking a bit chunkier. Hmm. Sorry, I had to cut some hacking and coughing out, you know, basic stuff. Let's try to impress another one of these. Just having three of us here does help. Even if our dance skills aren't as good as theirs, they still like our dancing, which is impressive. Oh well, still got some DNA out of that interaction, so that's good. Is a start. Okay, you're not even gonna try to reach that one. Huh, eat. A wordle. That's definitely a Maxis creature. I always tell the Maxis was have really nice color schemes. Oh, with the alpha. Yes, let's talk to him. Woo! <laughs> they launch over top of him, wow. 
What's happening? Turned by the music, we're going to have a meteor shower. Yep. Run! Yeah, running for cover is normally the best move at this point. Ooh, that sunlight effect's nice. A lot of the uh, neat effects you actually see in the air in this stage you can place in uh, other stages. Oh, god, you got into a fight. There's another one I created, the Insect King. That's for a, that's for a mission. Just hang out the nest for a bit, I guess, and heal. Look at that, there's two young. We're doing okay. I kind of want to just dismiss my pack member, actually. There's not much of a mechanic with having pe anyone like guard the nest, but you can definitely kind of drop them off there and go exploring by yourself. So that way you don't have to worry about the partners being stupid. Don't want to deal with that photo. I'm going to go talk to the Werbles again, because they are quite easy to deal with. It's the elephant. Let's talk to the baby. You can actually socialize with babies. It's hilarious. <coughs> Close. Yeah, we're gonna need two pack members to deal with these guys. Ooh, ground fruit. That's convenient. I do appreciate all our pack members just like running in to defend. Angurus is a tough foe. I actually designed him to be a fairly scrappy fighter. He's also for a mission. Come on, we can win this. Killed our mate. Victory! Let's eat him. And let's vomit. That's fun. This kind of advice to have a pack member with you at all times, even if you don't really need one. Yeah, I know, I failed. <clears throat> Back to the Werble Nest. Werbles? Where'd they go? I guess I don't know how many. Did they die out? Oh, no, they right. 
One thing I do wish that would be kind of neat if they ever did like an updated version of just the original Spore game. Because they actually had specific environmental niches for the creatures to fit into. I mean, it'd be pretty cool if you had the option of being like an underwater predator or something instead of just predator, herbivore, or an omnivore. Carnivore, I should say, instead of predator, you know. Got stuck or something? Up the hill. Up the hill. To the actual nest. There's the alpha one in front of him. I'll try with the baby again. We'll befriend your child. There we go. Get more DNA we're doing looking up in the world. We're so close to making an advancement too. Okay, that's the Angurious nest. Just stop flying this direction. I don't want to die! Herbals, help! What the hell is that? I have an ongoing feud with those, I think. I keep forgetting where their stupid nest is. Ooh, rotten food. There we go. I think we will attempt to upgrade again here. Socialize with you first. There we go, so we get one more pack member out of this. Then we'll get down to business. Still weird that we don't know when laying the egg in that. Computer fan noises, which, you know, hopefully aren't picking up. So, let's shorten ourselves a little bit. <laughs> Just a thought. Thanks. Again, I don't know what to do. Come on, give me a view I can grab. And scrunch. Okay, I think that's worse. We're pooping. Not quite what I want to do. Oh, yeah. That's the angle I want to achieve, definitely. Hmm. Okay, we have that one, and the next one is not cheap. Can do a little bit better for feet. So the old ones, buy the new ones. Put 
graspers. The sponge mitt. Weird. We can upgrade our horns finally. Not that. Yeah, there we go. God, this looks like some kind of Wendigo or something. I'm not sure else to word that. There. Slightly better. Do we have new wings yet? No. I would like to get new wings. Those the butterfly wings are not perfect. Most times they just sell them entirely, but being able to fly will get us out of bad situations with predators very quickly, and that's kind of what I'd like. It's a lot nicer than dying. And... did we crash? I hope not. Yeah, please. There we go. Hooray, we doubled our numbers. Kind of. Not really, but, you know. Kara. Okay, that's another one that I've made. These are larger than I remember making, remember ever making them. What the remains those guys are burning? You know, we'll explore more in this direction and see what we can do. See what we can befriend, what we can see, what might try to kill us, all that, all that good stuff. These hills are very difficult to navigate the best of times. Hmm. I wonder if we can take one of you guys with us. Let's take the Alpha. He's in our pack. There we go, we're a mixed species pack now, everything's good. First me flying with this guy in a possession is not a great idea. <laughs> what the hell is that? Kaneki. I have never seen that before, that's horrifying. Let's talk to it. Cabards. I normally have those in my game. Ooh, new wings. <laughs> he can't dance. Look how great it is having a creature in your pack that's not on scale with you. And just watching them fail in everything you try to do. My favorite one I did... Okay, we already know what we did. I befriended... Oh, they have two alphas. They have three alphas. Nice. Yeah, the one game I was playing, I ended up... 
care. I'm not yeah, what I mean, is it? Yeah. But I befriended like a early stage creature really late in the game. There's dragging this little like two legged cell behind us. It worked better than you thought. You think it would be? Yeah, I believe it got killed actually. <laughs> I'm going for to discover the epics because they're always the ones I have trouble with. Oh, our brain has grown. So in the background, there's another species I made. Looks like him. But more muscular, I don't like that. Yay, we look broken and horrible. We have more health now, too, so we can actually survive. Almost adult. Yes, that is another one I made. They were a development stage in another species. These were like the teenagers, pretty much. Well, let's see what you guys can do for us. Creatures I built are surprisingly easy to ally. It's another one I made, I believe. Okay, what? What's happening to that guy? <laughs> we'll cut him out of the pack. Something's killing him, and I don't know what. <laughs> Anything other than just that one move? Baby, almost adult. Okay, that. It's a great name. I think we have you isolated, buddy. Nope, the other's joined. Hey! Yeah, I made those. I recognize the spots on them. Are they friends or foe in this game? Yeah, they tend to be quite friendly creatures. I'm this is fun. Ooh. You can kind of glide. Boom. Oh, there's another one of them. The child variety. What the hell is that? Really trucking, and there's something that looks unfriendly. Yeah. Let's make friends with the child variety of that species, which is even more simple. Baby child. <laughs> Very similar, these ones have less feathers on their backs. Oh, you have a higher dance stat than you. You don't like it. Whoa, pack member. Insect King. It's raining, so then you only get with the high uh, graphics on. Let's go heal. Yeah, 
Yeah, the rain is a really neat effect. The enlightening, I didn't know that. And we are in the cloud now. <laughs> we'll soar overhead of. Oh god, we're crashing into the nest. It's something possibly unfriendly. Definitely unfriendly. Run! Multiple unfriendly nests. And we are poisoned. Ah, uh, oh, horrible. Horrible show, I apologize. But hey, there's still other creatures at the nest. Not many of us left. The female. Yeah, I think that's the, that's the one I'll be mating with. Out of the way, Junior! It's time to all of us again. Hey, stop clicking into me. After this, it should trigger the migration cutscene. And we haven't died this episode, so no crashes. <laughs> Remember what's having this cutscene happen? Shoves the egg out of the way. Where, when the cutscene, like, for the eggs hatching, it would our nests were just so surrounded by something big and nasty looking that wanted to kill all of us. Isn't that right, Miss Puss? My cat is currently sitting on me while I play, isn't that exciting? Elephant. Wings. 150. We'll do the wings first. These are actually proving to be quite useful. We have dragon wings. Ah, oh, these are like my favorite ones. Probably won't upgrade much off of them. See if we sell this head if we'll get enough to buy a new muzzle. Yes, good. Sing level five, bite level three. And we have a nose again. And that's what I call progress in a species. So much for those. 75, yeah. Feet, I want to upgrade on feet. Ultra Mega Deer. <laughs> Sorry, puss. I just shifted. My cat shifted with me. She didn't like that. Yep. Time for the Great Migration. I'll stay and look after the nest. Don't kick my computer. Grown up and we're gonna go it alone. I think <laughs> tiny wings are tiny. Yeah, I will get to the new home nest and then we will end the episode off there. The next nest will be a much more complicated affair to live at, and we'll probably die quite a bit. Just putting that out there. Hmm. I can take one of you guys with me. I can use an ally. 
He got pretty good health. Wait. Sorry. I'm sorry I suck. I don't want to take one of you with me if you are ugly. Just put it out there. But we can fly, so I'm not too worried. Actually gone off course to our nest, so I guess I'll swoop in around this way and see what we have for our species. We have Hulky Timus. The alphas for this species are very unintimidating. I think we can take them in a fight. I don't think I haven't seen yet actually is an epic. Normally they are right in your face. So I guess before we go to a tribal stage or any tribal stage, we'll try to find one. I'm curious to see what's going to give us as a you know man-eating giant. Or cellular-eating giant, I should say. Oh, the species looks familiar. Glitch dance away! And there we go, we've made a giant nest. Future generations will be born here. Ooh. Let's quickly check out what we have for DNA available. Sounder Snout. Oh, need that, we already have a mouth. Our eggs are now blue. And we have a lovely view of the blood red waters of our home planet. What? Oh. Oh. Okay then. That's not even least bit discomforting that spawned right by your nest. We will guard the egg. By guarding and kick it. <laughs> Species assemble. Calm down, you idiots. It will abduct things, by the way. That spaceship. It's targeting. Oh, guys, are coming after us. No, no. Come on. Come back. Unexpected detour for me ending the episode there, but. Better that no, nobody dies. Okay. Situation seems to be slightly improved. Come on, get out of here. Call everybody back. Um, abnormally eventful for Spore. So I'll leave us at this and next one we will hopefully progress that last extra bit there on our progress bar. 
and stop sucking and become a tribal creature. That is our next stage in development. Yes, Miss Plus, I know it's exciting. Yay, and the game saved. See you all next episode.